Minnesota's fifth tournament title, but the first as the head coach of Minnesota for Jamie Traxel. And how does that feel, coach? It's so much about the kids. You know, they've been through a lot this year through no choice of their own. And just proud of, like, everything they've been through and how we've been playing down the stretch here and using every situation. It's total team effort. It took everybody. We knew that coming into it. And uh, good teams find different ways to win, and we found a way to do that again today in a different way. So congratulations to them. And really, spe you know, really special day for our seniors in particular. Well, Coach, in this championship game, your team got off to a hot, hot start. What do you attribute that hot start to? Just being ready. I mean, I think we were just ready for the game to start. It's been it's been a challenging weekend for every team here, and I, I couldn't be prouder to be the coach of these kids and, and how we handle this whole entire weekend with our energy and intentionalism and three different games, three different ways to win. Uh, but we were ready to go, and, and I loved how we handled the, the fact that we had some opportunities late in the game too, and it didn't push those runs but kept our composure um, defensively and found, uh, found a way to do our job on that side of it to finish this game off. Well, you're arguing, or you're arguably fin or playing your best softball here down this stretch. Yeah. When did the switch turn for this team? It's been going on for a while in um, every situation. We've been getting better just before we started conference, and then we played Northwestern and um, had some tough lessons there. We were leading in two games and couldn't finish in the seventh inning and close it out. So um, it feels good today to be able to do that. And um, But we just kept getting better. We kept staying the course. We kept having conversations. We kept working hard. And it had been building for a long time. And we just tried to stay present each and every weekend and not try to look too far ahead. And we did a really good job of that, which is why I think we've made the strides that we have. And we've been able to, we can say that we're actually getting better as a team even now. You can say you're champions too. Thank you, Coach. Champions. Thank you very much. Maddie Houlihan, you're one of the upperclassmen here on this team. Are you going to sing for us? A championship song, I perhaps? After, I promise. Promise. <laughs> we'll hold you to that. I was going to ask, you're one okay. of the upperclassmen. Have you been a part of now three tournament titles? What makes this one so special? I think just the resilience of this team all year. You know, we had a bunch of roller coasters of weekends, and I think we're finally coming together as a team and playing like I knew we could all season long, and I'm just so proud to be a part of this, part of this program, part of these, with these girls, with these coaches. I mean, it was just a blast. Maddie, every at-bat in this tournament, you had that laser focus, performed at a very high level. You're just a tough out. Take us through your mindset as a hitter and your approach to this tournament. You know, I just wanted to come out and give my team a shot to win. So putting my best at-bats of the year forward and, um, you know, swinging at good pitches, taking balls, I think gave me the best shot to be a tough out. Just wanted to be a tough out. If they made a great play, give them credit, but just try to be a tough out. You were exactly that. In fact, it has earned you the most outstanding player of the tournament, Maddie Houlihan. Do well, you have an MOP song <laughs> prepared? Uh, you know, we have We Can't Stop by Miley Cyrus as our wing song, so we'll probably be jamming to that on the bus after this. Oh, not now during the interview? Well, I, they're busy. Oh, yeah! I'll dance with them. <laughs> Thank you, Maddie. Thank you. Kendall Lindemann, you've been a part now of two championships. What was the key in getting this team to championship form? Um, you know, it was just an all-over team win. You know, I think we really got our bats going together, and we had solid defense. So just giving it up to my team. Um, they did great today and the whole weekend. Kendall, you caught for three different pitchers in this championship game. What's it take to, to adjust to all three different pitchers in a, in a championship format like this? Um, you know, they make my job so easy, so it wasn't that hard for me. You know, they hit their spots, they, they throw it where it needs to go. Um, they're just all amazing, so for me it wasn't really a, a big change, you know. It was just right there for me, and all I had to do was catch it. Kendall, thanks for joining us, and congrats on another championship. Yeah, thank you.